Okay. <laughs> Hello. It's me. It's Mark. And I'm here for another live stream lesson with you. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Great. Great. And before I start, I need to know if you can see me, if you can hear me. Yeah. So I need to know if everything is a okay. So before I start, I need a yes in the comment stream for if you can see me, if you could hear me, I need a yes. All right. So if you can see me and if you can hear me, please say yes. So I know I can start. So I need a yes. I don't need a hello. I don't need a hi. I need a yes. A yes tells me that I can start. If I don't get a yes. Okay, Lolly. Thank you, Lolly. I always, I need a yes when I ask you if you could see me and if you can hear me. That way I know everything's okay and I see a yes. So thank you so much. Yes, that was Lolly. Mwah. Thank you, Lolly. And the green team is here. The green team is strong. Hello, Tetsuro. Hello, Eva. Hello, Sabine. Hello, Lolly. Hello, Tomas. Yes, okay, great, great, great. And I see... Our other people here too. Eleonora's in the house. Okay, Eleonora, great, great, great. And Jama's here. Oh, Violet is here. Great, great. Anna is here. Hello, Anna. Yay. 777 is here. Samuel is here. Okay, we got, we're off to a good start, everybody. And I really, really appreciate you guys are here. We're going to be here for a few hours. Yeah, we'll be here for two hours. Wow, so this is my first two-hour um, live stream for a while because I was in the hospital. Now I'm feeling much better, and I think I can do two hours. I think I can do it. I'm pretty sure I could do it. Let's try. <laughs> Ethiopian food. Hello. Okay, good, good. All right. Um, ben Hida. Hello. Okay, good, good. And... Shire is here. Good, good. Nada is here. All right. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Esther is here. Hello, Esther. All right. Well, let's be, well, you know what we have to do. Before we start, we always have a toast for good luck. Yeah, so we need a toast. If you have your beverage like I do right here, I have coffee. Yeah, hot black coffee. Whatever you have, I also have water too. Here's water. So I'm, I have both. So cheers is like when you bump glasses. Doo! Yeah. So I have water and coffee, but um, in my right hand is coffee. I am right handed. That means I use my right hand for most everything. So I am right handed. And because coffee is in my right hand, I'm toasting with coffee. Okay. So let's have a toast to the green team. Yes, the supporters of the channel. They make it happen. They're the supporters. Mwah, we have to say thank you to them. Yeah. And for you, cheers to you for being here. Because without you, there's no reason for me to be here. And a fun, interesting, and productive lesson. Yes, cheers. Tetsuro, hello, Ch Tetsuro. Okay, cheers, everyone. If you don't have a beverage, let's fist bump. Bum, bum, cheers, bum, bum, cheers, bum, bum, cheers. Okay, and because we had a toast, we have to have a drink. Cheers, everyone, to good luck. <laughs> mm. Okay, mm. very good, very good, very good. That tastes wonderful. All right, so we did our cheers, So or we did our toast. So now I'm going to tell you about today's lesson plan. Over there is today's lesson plan. You can't see it, but I can see it. It's off screen. Yeah, you can't see it, but I can see it it's right over there. Number one says hello. Oh, I need to do the official hello. Here is the official hello. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, wherever you are. Thank you for being here with, with me because without you, there's no reason for me to be here. So thank you so much. Yay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, good. Now, for our activities today. Um, our first activity is, how do you feel about it? So I'm going to give you a, a statement. I'm going to write a sentence, and then you're going to tell me how you feel about that 
in a number, okay? So you're not going to say yes, no, you're going to give me a number. So zero is you don't feel very strongly about it at all, or maybe you disagree, right? And then at 10, you might feel very strong about it, or you agree, okay? So you, you tell me how you feel about it with a number, okay? Then after we do that, we will do which one doesn't belong game. You know that one. There are four things, and you're going to tell me which one does not belong with the other three and why, all right? So that's most important, why. So you're going to tell me what doesn't belong and why, because. This doesn't belong, because. And then you're going to explain why you think that way. Then after that, we will do dictation cards, yeah? Then after our, oh, and dictation cards is where you listen and write down what I say word for word, all right? So you're listening and writing down what I say word for word. And then in the second part, we, we'll, we will shadow those dictation cards. That is, we will have some speaking practice and you will listen and speak at the same time. Don't repeat, speak at the same time, yeah? Where, um, where shadowing is happening much quicker, real time, where um, w when you're um, repeating, you're, you're listening, pausing, and then saying what I said. So uh, shadowing is real time communication, and it's a challenge, but it's good for you. That's why you're here for a challenge. Yeah. And then we will do Lolly's Revenge. Yes, Lolly's Revenge is a conversation between two people. Joe and Sue, Joe and Sue, and there are four steps. Step one, I will read the conversation. Step two, I will ask you questions about the conversation. Step three, we will read the conversation, and step four, we will shadow the conversation, okay? Sounds good? Yeah, so we're busy today. We have many things to do, so we got to get right to it. Um, Kittis is here. Hello, Kittis. Yeah, Maya's here. Okay, great. So we have a good group here today. We have our usual suspects. We are strong, united together. Mina's here. Yeah, we have great people here. We have a great class, and it's all because of you. <laughs> yes. Okay, let's get right to it, everyone. Our first activity is how do you feel about it? How do you feel about it? So I have some statements. I'm going to write the statement, and you're going to you're going to tell me how you feel about it with a number, with a number. Okay, so I'm going to write the activity here. How do you feel about it? How do you feel about it? How do you feel about it? And you're going to give me a number, okay? So 1 through 10. Okay, and so zeros, um, you don't feel very strong about it. So, um, what should I say? So, um, okay, well, I, I'll think of something after, okay? So right now, I'll just put zero to 10, okay? Larissa! <laughs> Mwah, Larissa! <laughs> Larissa, thank you so much. Right off the start. Thank you so much, Larissa. You are wonderful. I love you, Larissa. You are a wonderful person. Yes, you are. And I'm going to send you today's dictation cards, okay, Larissa? Thank you. I'm going to, Larissa's on the board. You are super kind, Larissa. Love you. You are, you have a big, big heart. That's why there's a big, big heart next to your name. <laughs> And I'm going to send you, I have your email address, so I'm going to send you today's dictation cards, Laura. Mwah, thank you so much for your kind, kind support. I really, really appreciate it. Okay, so we're going to do how do you feel about it, and you're going to tell me how you feel about it with a number from 0 to 10. 0, you don't feel very strong. You disagree, maybe. 10, you feel very strong. You agree, okay? So let's do it, yeah? All right, so I have um, the statements here. And the, the topic is healthful, healthful activities. Health, 
full activities. Healthful activities. Okay, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to write that on the board as well. Health, healthful, healthful healthful activities healthful activities so th activities that uh, make you healthy right healthy activities things that we do to keep healthy right because we need to stay healthy everybody yes yes we do okay so if you agree if this is a healthy activity you put a number right so if you, if you don't feel very strong, um, not strong, and then um, very strong. Okay, so this is how you feel. You don't feel very strong about it, you feel very strong about it, okay? And our first one is, our first statement is, Walk a dog for 20 minutes for 20 minutes every morning. Okay, how do you feel about it? What number are you going to put on it? Yeah, Larissa. Okay, everyone loves Larissa. Yes, we do. Okay. Now, what kind of number? How, how, how healthy is this? Okay. How, how healthy is it? How, how much exercise is it? How, how do you feel about it? Okay. So, walk a dog for 20 minutes every morning. How healthy is that? Oh, who's not? has a 10. Oh, so that's like way, very strong. So uh, Husna feels very strong about it. Oh, okay. Ben Hira feels very strong about it, a 10. Wow, we got 10, 10. Larissa has an 8. So she, she feels mm, more than average, right? Julie is a 5. So Julie is like on the fence here. So 5 is in the, in the middle. All right, so five is in the middle. Tetsuro's at eight. Ava's at ten. Tomas, it's good for health. Walking a dog every morning. Rita, hello, Rita. Mwah, good to see Rita. Okay. Ella has a four. So maybe the exercise isn't, you know, walk for 20 minutes because maybe your dog goes a little slow, right? So, so I go walking in the morning. I don't have a dog. So I just, just walk myself. But you see people, I see people walking their dogs, and they are going very slowly, right? They are walking very slowly. Um, oh, Lolly, this is interesting. Lolly said 10, very healthy, even psychologically healthy. So that means healthy for your mind, yeah? Muhammad, hello, Muhammad single. Um, so Lolly's saying it's very, it's psychologically healthy, meaning it's healthy for your mind, right? Of course, walking is, is healthy for our body, but maybe walking a dog is also healthy for your mind. Yeah, okay. Uh, Ava says, when we take care about a dog, um, I'm not sure, with, with my son, I enjoy very well. Oh, so when I... Um, Walk, when I take care of a dog with my son, we feel very well. So very healthy, right? So you have a dog, you take care of your dog, you feed your dog, you take your dog for a walk, and that makes you feel healthy. Very good. Okay, Maya, when I had a dog, I liked it. Good, good. Okay, so I'm going to say, um, let's see, how do you feel about it? Walk a dog for 20 minutes every morning. I think that, yeah, I'm going to put an 8. I'm not going to put a 10, but I'm going to put an 8. Okay, here's 2. Here's 2. 2 is follow, tr 
traffic laws where safety where safety equipment ride a motorcycle often okay how how's that healthy healthful activity so follow traffic laws wear safety equipment ride a motorcycle often okay so you you're riding a motorcycle often maybe every day okay maybe you're you're riding a motorcycle to work you're riding a motorcycle to school maybe you're riding a motorcycle to a um, club activity maybe you know a, a tennis club or basketball team so you're riding a motorcycle often you're following the traffic laws right so you s the light says red so you stop the light says green so you go a stop sign you stop right so you're following all the laws the speed limit right the speed limit says 50 miles an hour so you're going 50 miles an hour so you're following the traffic laws wear safety equipment so you're wearing a helmet gloves jacket pants okay so boots so you're wearing safety equipment and you ride a motorcycle every day so how is that for your health how is that for your safety <laughs> okay so number two who's um hasan or Husna says a 10. So number two, a 10. Wow, very, very healthy. Okay, Anna says two, in my city it is not safe. So Anna has a very low number because maybe riding a motorcycle is dangerous where she lives. Tomas has a 10. Larissa has a 10. Okay, Jama, a two, every day, yeah, a two. Oh, Violet has a 10, okay. Um, where I live, my city, it's dangerous, I think. Riding a motorcycle is dangerous. Wynn has a 10, okay, so we have, we have some 10s and we have some twos here. Marcos, hello, Marcos. Mwah. How you doing, Marcos? Khan has a five. Okay, I'm going to go more like Khan, I think, because you might follow the traffic laws. You're wearing the safety equipment, but a car, maybe another car is not following the rules, right? You're on the motorcycle. You are following the traffic laws, but maybe a car is not, and they can just hit you like that, and you can get hurt. So, um, yeah, Rita... Rita doesn't ride a motorcycle. Julia says, five, it is not safe for driving. Muhammad has a two. Okay. Tomas says, I think it is really good even though I don't ride a motorcycle. Okay. So I'm going to put, uh, uh, I'm going to put five. Okay. I'm going to do five. I if you're, if you're being safe, right, you're following the laws, you're wearing your safety equipment, I think maybe you'll be okay, 50%, okay? So I'm going to put a five as well. I, I do not ride a motorcycle. I did in high school. I've had a motorcycle in my life. And when I was a student in high school, no helmets. <laughs> when, when, when I had, I had, I had a, 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 small, a small motorcycle. I had a moped. So I've had a few bikes, motorcycles in my life. And when I was young, and we did not wear helmets. <laughs> there was no helmet law. So um, I guess I was lucky. Like I rode a, a motorcycle to school for a couple years. 
and never wore a helmet, <laughs> but never got in an accident. So I was lucky, I guess, lucky. Okay, let's do number three, number three. Kayak every weekend on a river. Okay, how healthy is that? Hello, Sashi. Hello, hello, Sashi. Okay. Yeah, yeah, mild. So the unexpected, yep, because we don't know what the other what the other people are doing, right? So if you're on a motorcycle, maybe you are being safe, you are riding very skillfully, but we don't know about the other cars, right? Okay, here we go. Number three, kayak every weekend on a river. Kayak every weekend on a river. Oh, no, don't be afraid, Tomas. <laughs> It's fun. Oh, okay, Larissa, a two. Okay, Khan, kayak is kind of like a little, um, like a little boat you sit in and you you have a paddle. So a kayak kind of looks like this. And and you sit inside and then you have a pat you have a stick or a paddle. And it, it goes like this. Something like that, right? And, and so you are sitting down and you're going, and you're going down the river. So you're using your arms and you're, you're going down the river and through the rocks. And, and so it's like a little boat that you sit down in. Okay, you want to try it. Anna wants to try kayaking. I've done it a few times. It's fun. Kayaking is fun. Kayak is, a, is good, but you should be able to swim. Of course, Maya, swimming is very important. Yes, it is. When you go into the water, you should know how to swim. If you don't know how to swim, don't go in the water for sure. Don't go in the water if you can't swim. Larissa, oh, I don't swim well. Well, Larissa, so swimming's just practicing, right? Uh, actually, I'm a very good swimmer. I like swimming. I'm a very good swimmer. Um, so Larissa, so swimming is just practice. So you just need more practice. So it's really healthy. It's good for your body. And it's just practicing, right? The more you swim, the better you get. Oh, Kusana says, I think it is dangerous. A three. Ella's a six. Maya's a eight. Eight to ten. Maya, you have to give me one number. You can't give me eight to ten. No, 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 no. One number. Choose a number, Maya. Choose a number. Okay. Okay, what um what number? Ben Kira, what number? Kayak is very good. What number? Tomas says, I never sat in a kayak. You should try. If you get a chance to um, rent a kayak, you should try it. When I cannot swim. Oh, no. Swimming is, is wonderful. You should learn to swim. You should learn to swim. It's wonderful. It's wonderful. What is a kayak? This is a kayak right here. You sit down in it. And you, you um, there's paddles, and you, you go in the water. You move in the water like a, like a little boat, but you're you're controlling it with with your hands. These paddles, you're controlling it. Oh no, Lolly! I didn't ignore. I didn't see. So Lolly ignores when I on purpose. I. I did not I did not do it on purpose. I did not ignore Lolly. I didn't see. So there's a 
big difference between ignore and didn't see. And I'm going to look right here. I see it now. Lolly, you said eight. Even if kayaking is risky, sport. So I think that's a good number, Lolly. I'm going to do that too because it is a little dangerous um, if you hit your head on the rocks, if you crash, right? So I'm going to, I agree with you. I'm going to give it an eight. I'm going to give it an 8, too. Okay, so kayak every weekend on a river, an 8. I agree. So, yeah, so Ava, you should try it. You should give it a try. Hey, Floor, how are you doing, Floor? Uh, kayak is a lot of adrenaline. So you get, like, um, that energy, right? It gives you the adrenaline, gives you the power. Yeah, I agree, Floor, I agree. Yes, and um, Violet says, wear a life jacket. Of course, that's a great idea because if you hit your head on the rock and you might black out, if you have a life jacket, you can float and you will be safe. Okay, good. Oh, no, another. I don't know how to swim. Yes, you need to learn to swim. Okay, Khan says, I haven't got any idea about kayak, but as a physical activity, it must be adventurous for time being so far. Okay, so yeah, a seven. Okay, good. Okay, all right. Ava says, I can swim, but I'm not good at it. Ava says, I can swim, but I'm not very good. I can swim, but I am not very good. Yeah, so Lolly, I, I, I would never ignore you, Lolly. Of course, you know that. I would never ignore you. I just sometimes don't see, see your comments. I'm sorry. Okay, dangerous, a little dangerous. Kumar, that's okay. That's fine. That's why you are here. You are here with me to practice. Okay, let's do one more. We'll do four. Okay, let's do one more. Number four. Okay, it's our last one. Number four. Drink one to two glasses of wine every night. Okay, number four, drink one to two glasses of wine every night. How is that? What number? You don't think it's very healthy? Ten, you think it's very healthy, okay? Not very healthy, very healthy, okay? Four, drink one to two glasses of wine every night. Drink one to two glasses of wine every night. That's number four. Number four. Oh, Julia is a one. Not very, wow, Julia, not, not very healthy. Not very healthy. Ella, zero. Wow, zero. <laughs> zero. Hello, Mabdo. Mabdo. Hello. So, Zero, I see a zero. Wow, wow, wow. A zero, a zero. Okay. Ten. I see a ten. Wynn's got a ten. Very healthy. Only red, dry wine. A ten. Tetsuro, a five. Ava, zero. Every night is not very good. Lolly, a seven if you don't drink more than two glasses. Lolly has a seven if you don't drink more than two. Sabine, a two, very low. Okay. Uh, Zashi, <laughs> okay. Um, oh, Rachna, a zero. Husna, a zero. I don't think not very healthy at all. Larissa, a one, <laughs> weekends only. Ava has a 10. Two glasses every weekend is good for your health. Okay, Violet, 
a three. Marcos, five, because it might be an addiction. Okay, that's a good point. If you're drinking wine every night, maybe it's an, an addiction, and so that's not very healthy. Tomas, depends on how big that glass is. <laughs> Tomas, yes, it does. If it's a big, big glass. <laughs> if it's a little glass, maybe no problem. Yes, Tomas, very good um, observation. Yes, so that is um, very important. Yes, Tomas, how big is the glass? <laughs> Okay, zero, Maya. One glass is enough, not every night. Um, Muhammad says, three glasses very well for me. <laughs> so Muhammad single likes three. Okay, depends on the size of the glass. Yes, Roman. Okay, we got a 10. We got Newton says, every night not healthy, but sometimes maybe I'm a nurse. Okay, so we have some experts. Yeah, Lolly's a nurse. Um, Norton's a nurse. Okay, Lolly. <laughs> Tomas, good point. Good point, Tomas. Okay, I don't drink every night. Uh, I don't drink wine. I have beer a few, a few times a week. Um, I'm going to say... I'm going to, hmm, I'm not going to go zero. I'm not going to go 10. I'm going to go five. I'm going to go five. Because um, maybe if I have a small glass, yeah, I don't, that's tough. That's, that's difficult. If it makes you happy, if it helps you sleep, if you don't do, you know, if you don't smoke and you just, just drink a little. I think maybe it'd be okay. I think it might be okay. I don't do that, but um, I don't know. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. Okay, I'm looking at the clock. Let's, let's do our next activity, okay? However, before we do our next activity, let's review this one, okay? So here, let's look at it one more time. So how do you, okay, our topic is healthful activities healthful activities, yeah, and um, our activities, how do you feel about it, how do you feel about it, and zero is you don't feel very strong about it, ten, you feel very strong about it, okay, one, walk a dog for 20 minutes every morning, I think that's an eight, so not a ten, but I think it's an eight, two, follow traffic laws, wear safety equipment, Ride a motorcycle often, a five. So I think you might be complete, you know, you're following the rules, you're a good, you know, you ride a motorcycle very well, you're wearing safety equipment, but if another car does something bad, you have no control over other cars. So I'm gonna say a five. Three, kayak every weekend on a river. Um, I think it's good exercise. It's a little dangerous, so I'm going to go eight. Drink one to two glasses of wine every night. I don't do it, but maybe, you know, a lot of people do it, and they're healthy, so I'm going to put a five, okay? So that's our how do you feel about it activity. Uh, okay, our next activity is um, which one doesn't belong, okay? Right here. However, before we do it, I'm going to take a picture of the whiteboard because we need the space for the whiteboard, okay? So I need to erase this information. However, before I erase this, I'm going to take a picture of it so you can check it out anytime you want by going to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, and that way you can check out the whiteboards anytime you want to. If you want to have a look at the whiteboards, go to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, and you will find the whiteboards there. Okay, and I have my camera is open, so I'm going to step over here, take the picture. You can't see me, but you can hear me. And I'm going to take a picture. Here we go. Let's count down. Five, four, three, two, one. 
Okay, I got the picture. Yes, I do. So now I can erase the whiteboard because I will upload that this on my Facebook group page, okay? So, all right. So our next activity will be which one doesn't belong. So I'm going to give you four items, four things, and you're going to tell me which one of those four doesn't belong and why. Why doesn't it belong? So please tell me how you feel about it. Well, not how you... Tell me the, the reason why you think it doesn't belong, okay? All right, so I'm going to write our next activity here. It says, well, I'm going to put, the activity is which one doesn't belong? Which one doesn't belong? Okay, and we are going to have a couple rounds. Okay, here we got the round. And so let's start with round one. And then what doesn't belong and why? Because. Okay, and as you know, because you've done this before, we've done this before, because is the most important part of this activity. It's not so much telling me which one doesn't belong, but the most important is to tell me why, 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 okay? Because I want you to um, use your imagination, use your, your um, creativity, use your critical thinking skills, okay? And um, of the four things, which one doesn't belong because da-da-da-da, okay? Here we go, round number one. That's right. Which one doesn't belong and why? <laughs> yes, Lolly. Which one doesn't belong and why? Okay, good. Here we go. HB's in the house. Hello, HB. Mwah. Hello, HB. Okay, good. Here we go. Round number one, everyone. Here are the four things. A clothes hanger, a chair, a sofa, and a bed. Which one doesn't belong? One more time. A clothes hanger, a chair, a sofa, a bed. Which one doesn't belong and why? Here we go. One more time. A clothes hanger, a chair, a sofa, a bed. Which one doesn't belong and why? Which one doesn't belong and why? Haitis, hello, Haitis. Okay, which one doesn't belong and why? Which one? Which one? A clothes hanger, a chair, a sofa, and a bed. Clothes hanger, a chair, a sofa, and a bed. Which one doesn't belong and why? Okay, Haita says, I need a chair because my family will come to my house for dinner. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ava, sofa because it's for a nap. Oh, very good. Yeah, so a bed is like we sleep in it. A uh, chair, we can't take a nap. Clothes hanger, we can't do that. Okay, very good. I like that, Ava. Lolly says, a clothes hanger because you cannot sit in it. Okay, that's right, Lolly. A clothes hanger is not for sitting, no. Maya, a clothes hanger because it's over the others. Very interesting. So there is no wrong answer, right? So, so a chair is on the floor. A sofa is on the floor. A bed is on the floor. But a clothes hanger is up in the air. <laughs> good, good, good. Okay, one more time. Sabine asks one more time. Here we go. Sabine, a clothes hanger, a chair, 
a sofa and a bed. Which one doesn't belong? A clothes hanger, a chair, a sofa, and a bed. Which one doesn't belong and why? Khan says... A clothes hanger doesn't belong because it isn't furniture. Very good, Khan. I like it. You guys are doing very well. Yes, you guys know this game. Tomas, a clothes hanger because we cannot sit on it. Yes, yes. Okay. Um, Mado, why sofa? You have to tell me why because this is most important. I need to know why, why. Um, Haitis, why bed? Okay, we need to know why, why, why. Julia says, a clothes hanger because it is not, okay, I saw that. Uh, HB says, clothes hanger because it's not for resting. Yes, <laughs> that's right. Okay, Muhammad, single, sofa, why, why, why? Tell me why. That's most important. I need to know why. Marginal voice, hello. Uh, clothes hanger because Okay, yeah, okay, so a clothes hanger we cannot sit in, right? So a chair, we sit in a chair. We sit in a sofa. We um, lie down in a bed. Tessero, a clothes hanger because we can't rest on it. Very good. Eva, I don't know what a clothes ha hanger, clothes hanger. So that's where we put our shirts on. We hang our clothes on it. So a clothes hanger looks like this. Okay, that's a clothes hanger. And we use this to hang our clothes. I don't use one. <laughs> Maybe you can tell my shirts are, I do not use a clothes hanger because my shirts are always wrinkled. <laughs> okay, Lolly says, Clothes hanger because you need two words to ring use it. Okay, I don't know what that one word is. So, but two words, right? Clothes hanger, yes. Clothes hanger, chair, sofa, bed, yes. So you guys are using your imagination. Okay, that's right. Everyone's doing good. Okay, so I, I see lots of... Um, Sabine, clothes hanger because it hangs in the closet. Yes. Uh, Larissa, clothes hanger because it's small. So I like all these different answers. I like all these different answers. Very good. Um, Lolly says, sofa because I am a couch potato. <laughs> so you rest in a sofa. You sit in a chair. You, you sleep in a bed and... A clothes hanger hangs clothing. Okay, good. All right. Ava, um, okay, I'm not sure what Ava, I don't know what that first word is there. Rita, uh, so for because my dog sleeps on it. <laughs> okay, good. Marcos, what's the difference between clothes hanger and wardrobe? Clothes hanger is is the, the wire hanger or sometimes a wood hanger, right? And a wardrobe is like a closet. It's a piece of furniture like this, right? This is kind of like a wardrobe. And, right, and so, and so your, your clothing, you open the door and you hang your clothes in there, in the wardrobe. So in the wardrobe, there'll be, and then, yeah, and then you have, and then you put like your, your shirt hangs on there. Okay, so, so clothes hang in the wardrobe. And this is a clothes hanger. It's a wire or wood. Okay, good, good. Yeah, so marginal voice, yes, clothes hanger because we cannot sit or lie on it. Yeah, so that, that's my answer too. So clothes hanger.
A clothes hanger is because uh, we can't use it to um, rest. Right, so we can't use it to rest. So we can, we can sit in a chair to rest. We, of course, we could use a sofa to rest and a bed to rest. But a clothes hanger is for clothing, right? It's for clothing. And actually, we can say this. How about this? Here's another um, uh, um, clothes hanger because it's not for people. Or um, it's for clothes, right? A clothes hanger because it's for clothes. A clothes hanger because... It's for clothing, right? So a, a clothes hanger is for clothing. A chair, a sofa, and a bed is for people, <laughs> yeah? So a chair, a sofa, a sofa, and a bed is for people. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, nice. Mm -mm. Larissa says, clothes hanger because you can take it with yourself. Or you, you can take it along. You can take it along. How about that? Clothes hanger because you can take it along. Right? So you could take it along on a trip. Okay. A clothes hanger because you can take it along on a trip. How's that? L Larissa. That's a good one, Larissa. A clothes hanger because you can take it along on a trip. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, let's do one more. Let's let's do another one. Oh, thank you, Violet. Violet says, you draw well. <laughs> Sometimes and sometimes not, Violet. Sometimes it comes out okay and sometimes it comes out horrible. So, so um, it's just sometimes I can draw well and sometimes I can't. Okay, let's do number two. Number two. Okay, which one doesn't belong and why? Which one doesn't belong and why? Okay, here we go. Round number two, everyone. Round number two. Two. Okay, here we go. Here are the four things. Headphones, eyeglasses, a cowboy hat, a face mask. Okay, one more time. Headphones, eyeglasses, a cowboy hat, a face mask. Headphones, eyeglasses. A cowboy hat, a face mask. Headphones, eyeglasses, a cowboy hat, a face mask. Which one doesn't belong and why? Which one doesn't belong and why? Headphones. Okay, Maya says, along on a trip means to take with you on a trip. Yes. Right? So, Maya, you can take it along on a trip. Yeah? So, right here, take it, Maya. Clothes hanger is it. Because, a clothes hanger because you can take it along on a trip. You can take it with you on a trip. Okay. Headphones, eyeglasses, a cowboy hat, and a face mask. And Tomas is on the board. Headphones because it is for entertainment. Very good. Yes, I like it, Tomas. Good Good, good um, answer there, Tomas. Ava, face mask, because we use it for our health. Lolly says, a cowboy hat, because you wear it on your head, not 
on your face. What about headphones? Okay, headphones, Lolly, headphones. Oh, Tetsuro, headphones because it is electric equipment, yeah, electronic. Yes, good, Tetsuro, electronic, right? So we use it to listen to music, right? Eyeglasses are just, we use, they're just glasses that, that we use to see, help us see, a hat and a face mask. But headphones, we need power, right? You need power. Good, Tetsuro. Um, okay, Jama, why face mask? I need to know why. Because, because. This is most important. Because. Okay, marginal voice. Eyeglasses, because it is usually made of glass or fiber, and we use it for seeing. Okay, I wouldn't say fiber. Um, I would say, you know, glass or plastic, okay? So you might, you might want to say marginal voice, made of glass or plastic. It's used for seeing, yes. Okay, Muhammad single, face mask, because we use that for our health, that very good for our health. Yeah, so a face mask we use um, for health and to protect other people, to keep ourselves healthy, keep other people healthy. Yes, good. Khan says, I think face mask because it can't be a basic necessity. I think face mask because it can't be a basic necessity. Why Khan not basic necessity? Why? Why do you say not basic necessity? Okay. Uh, Husna says face mask because it protects you from COVID-19. Okay, Anna, headphones because it cannot be used without other gadget. Whoa! Let's see, Anna, great answer. So Anna's saying headphones alone does nothing. You need, we need um, like a, and we need like a music player, right? Where, you know, eyeglasses are just here. They're used by themselves. A hat is used by itself. And a mask is used by itself. Very good. But headphones cannot be used by themselves, itself. It can't be used by itself. Julia, um, cowboy hat because we don't use it, um, use our ears wearing it. Oh, Julia. Yes, Julia. Very good. Julia is saying um, a cowboy hat because it, we don't use our ears, right? Headphones over our ears. Eyeglasses connect over our ears, right? And a face mask connects over our ears. Very good. Yes, yes. Nice, nice, nice. I love these great answers. Um, Ava says a hat because it's on top of our head. But uh, what about headphones? Headphones go over our head. Um, right? So headphones go over our head. Marcos, cowboy hat doesn't belong because it comes from an animal. Cowboy hat, oh, like a leather one. Maybe a leather cowboy hat comes from an animal, a cow, yeah. Samuel says, a face mask because it's not for fashion. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay, good, good, good. Yeah, yeah. So um, glasses are fashionable. Um, uh, a, a cowboy hat got different colors. It's fashion. That's right. Headphones like um, young people. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, good one, Samuel. I like that one. Cowboy hat because it's not on our face. Okay, HB. Cowboy hat because it's not on our face. I guess, okay, I'll, I'll agree. Okay, headphones might be touching our face, close to our face. Okay, good. Cowboy. Um, okay, um, Esther, cowboy hat. What is, cowboy, um, what is, please? Cowboy hat. So cowboys, they ride a horse 
And um, so they have a special hat, and it's a big hat, right? Cowboy hat. And uh, let's see, uh, like this, and then has like a, a brick. So this might be like a cowboy hat, okay? And so cowboys, cowboys use them when they're like riding on a horse, and it's a big hat, and it protects their head against the sun. That's right. That's right, Marcos. Like ear protection, right? In, um, if you're working in a factory and there's lots of noise, that's good, Marcos. So actually, um, we can say cowboy hat because it's not used for protection. Yeah? So a face mask we use for protection, right, from, from, um, from the flu, right, or from, from germs, right? We use a face mask to protect us from germs. Safety glasses protects our eyes. And um, headphones protects our hearing. Yeah, I like it, I like it, I like it. Cow well, cowboy hat protects us from the sun. They all protect us, all four, right? So a cowboy hat protects us from the sun. Headphones can protect our hearing. Eyeglasses can protect our eyes. And a face mask protects us from germs. So they, they all can protect us. Okay, well, my answer is cowboy hat, but because it doesn't, relate to our senses, I guess. Okay, so a cowboy, a cowboy hat. A cowboy hat, because it doesn't touch our senses. Okay, so headphones touches our ears, our hearing, right? That's a sense. Eyeglasses cover our eyes, right? Seeing, that's a sense. And a mask protects our mouth, and that's a sense, right? Um, taste. So there's a lot. I like your answers. My answer is eh, not so good. I like, I like your answers. Face masks, because COVID is very bad disease, too, much, too many people. Too many, okay, Kittis, too many people have died. That's true, that's true. Emily, hello, Emily. Mwah, good to see Emily. Welcome, welcome, Emily. Cowboy hat is only for boys. No, 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 no. Anna, cowboy hats for women too. Men and women. Mm. Yes, yes, Ava. Headphones, because we listen to something. That's right. Good, good, good. Okay, well, let's do our dictation cards now, okay? I'm going to show you the pictures, okay? And we're going to do more, so I'm going to put a piece of paper here so you can't see. Next week, we're going to do more, okay? So let's, I'm going to show you the the topics here, okay? So there's a clothes hanger, a chair, a sofa, and a bed. And a clothes hanger is because we cannot rest in it. It's not for people, it's for clothing, right? A chair is for people, a sofa is for people, and a bed is for people. And then here we have headphones, eyeglasses, cowboy hat, and a face mask. And I said a uh, cowboy hat because it doesn't touch one of our senses, right? Headphone touches our ears, eyeglasses touch our eyes, and face masks touch our mouth. Okay, good, 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 good. All right. Okay, same one. All right, nice, nice, new. Okay, let's do our next activity is dictation practice. Yay, dictation practice. Woohoo! Oh, 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 oh. Before we do, Dictation practice, 
I need to take a picture of the whiteboard so I can, because I need to erase the whiteboard. However, before I erase it, I'm going to take a picture of it so you can check it out anytime you want to. Just go to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, and you can check it out anytime you want to. Yes, you can. Okay, I'm going to step over here to take the picture. You can't see me, but you can hear me. Okay, here we go. Okay, four, three, two, one. Okay, got the picture. Got the picture. Okay, good, good, good. Yes. Okay, I'm going to erase the whiteboard so we can do our card dictation. Yeah. So you need a pencil and paper, everybody. Pencil and paper, please. Take out your paper. Take out a piece of paper. Take out a pencil. Okay, here we go, go. Okay, so you need a, you need a pencil. You need paper. Paper and pencil. Paper and pencil. We're going to do dictation practice. And today's topic is challenge. Challenge, challenge. Okay, challenge. Woohoo. And um, it is. For example, it means I want to try. I want to try. Okay. We can challenge somebody. to do something. Okay, challenge someone to do something. Okay, okay. So challenge, I want to try. Challenge somebody to do something. Okay, challenge, challenge, challenge. Okay, and we have right here one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cards. We always have eight cards. Yes, yes, yes. And I'm going to shuffle the cards. I always shuffle the cards. <laughs> I don't know why. I just do it. I shuffle whenever I have cards. I want to shuffle. When I have cards in my hand, I want to shuffle. When I have cards in my hands, I want to shuffle. When I have cards in my hands, I want to shuffle. When I have cards in my hands, I want to shuffle. <laughs> okay, and I'm going to read each card three times, okay? Each card only three times. So I want you to stop shuffling. Okay, Lolly, no more. Put the cards down. No more shuffling. <laughs> okay, I'm going to read each card three times. Only three times. Challenge somebody to do something. Yes, marginal voice. Let's do it. Challenge. I challenge you. I challenge you to dictation practice. Okay. I challenge you to do dictation practice. Challenge somebody to do something. I challenge you to do dictation practice. I challenge you to do dictation practice. I challenge you to do dictation practice. <laughs> Here we go. Ava, my challenge is to speak English fluently. I challenge Ava to speak English fluently. I challenge Ava to speak English fluently. Yes. <laughs> Shuffling is from habit. I have a habit of shuffling when I have cards in my hands. Okay, here we go, everybody. Are you ready? I challenge you to do dictation practice, Lolly. Lolly, I challenge you to do dictation practice. Okay, here we go. One card, three times. One card, three times. Here we go. Card number one. 
She is always looking for new challenges. Good, Ava. She is always looking for new challenges. Lolly. Challenge. I challenge Lolly. Okay. Number three. Third time. Third time. Third time. She is always looking for new challenges. Lolly, let's go. Okay, Lolly's on the board. She is always looking for new challenges. Very good. Muhammad, she's always looking for new challenges. Tetsuro, she is always looking for new challenges. Marginal voice. <laughs> good, marginal. I challenge Ava to speak English fluently. Nice. Rita. She is always looking for new challenges. Marcos, she is always looking for new challenges. Maya, she is always looking for new challenges. Anna, she is always looking for new challenges. Yes, yes, yes. Larissa, she is always looking for new challenges. Tomas, she is always looking for new challenges. Violet, she is always looking for new challenges. All right, Ethiopian food, she is always looking for new challenges. Marginal voice, she, he is always looking for new challenges. Ava, she is always looking for new challenges. Very good, Ava. Flora, she is always looking for new challenges. Good, okay, yes, number one, she is always looking for new challenges yes sabine she is always looking for new challenges nice esther she is always looking for new challenges very good nicely done everyone here we go card number two number two countdown rita english is a new challenge for me but i don't give up rita you're, it's not new for Rita. You're an ex excellent English speaker. Rita, excellent. You're an excellent English speaker, Rita. Okay, here we go. Number two. Countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Card number two. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Number two. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Zashi. <laughs> okay, this is the third time. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. <laughs> yes, Jama. Okay, who's got number? Okay, Lolly's on the board. I challenged. Okay, Lolly, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Rita, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Tomas, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Okay, Tetsuo's got it. Tetsuo, nice. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Henna, good. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Ava, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Yes, Ava. Marginal voice. I challenged, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Ethiopian food. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Marcos, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Challenged 
K. Muhammad. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Emily, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Perfect, Emily, perfect. Okay, Lolly fixed it. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Good. Yes, challenged Larissa. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Kittist. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Sabine, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Good. Tomas, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Violet, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Samuel, Samuel, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Rita, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Esther, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Floor, I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. Very good. I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. All right, very good. Let's go number three. <laughs> Hi, Floor. Okay, card number three. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Card number three. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Woo! It's a long one. Ava, I'm sorry, Ava. It's a challenge, Ava. It's a challenge for you, Ava. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. This is the third time. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Did you get on three? Did you get it? in three times it's a long sentence okay Muhammad's on the board I don't know if it will work but let's give it a try Tetsuro I don't know I don't know if it will work but let's give it a try perfect Tetsuro Lali I don't know if it will work but let's give it a try. Good, Lolly. Ava, I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. <clears throat> okay, Mohammed, I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Emily, I don't know if it will work, if it will work, but let's give it a try. I don't know if it will, will, it will. Tomas, I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Larissa, I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Maya, I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Samuel, I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Okay, Th Irene, Irene, I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Ava, I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Okay, good, Ava, let's give it a try. Good, 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 Ava, so break it up in two, that's good. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Okay, Marcos. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Marginal voice. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Ethiopian. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Larissa. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Good. Emmy. 
I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Sabine, I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Maya, okay, good, yeah, 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 thank you. All right, Juliet, hello, we have a new member. Woo, everyone, we have a new green member, Juliet. Hello, Juliet. Welcome, Juliet. Mwah, we got a new member. Thank you, Juliet. Yes, yes, yes. The green team is strong. The green team is growing. Yes. Juliet, thank you so much for your kind support. Mwah. Thank you, Juliet. We got a new green member. We like our green members. Thank you, Juliet. I should have like special music for um, for new members. Okay, let me let me see if we can. I'm going to see if I can find some. Let's let's try this. Let's see wh what's going to happen. What 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 can happen? Okay, here we go. I'm going to just congratulations music. Okay, let's see. Some. Uh, I I I can't be someone famous. It has to be just. Um. General, how about I'll, I'll do this. General. General. Okay, general. Congratulations, music. Uh, here, here's this. I don't know how this is going to work. Uh, this is taking too long. Let's see. Congratulations, music. No. I can't find it. <laughs> I don't know. I, I need, I, I'll search for it in the future. <laughs> Juliet, welcome, welcome. Yay, Juliet. Okay, good, good, good. Yes. Okay, number three. I don't know if it'll work, but let's give it a try. Juliet, yes, welcome to the green team. You're amongst friendly, wonderful people. One more time, Juliet. You are amongst wonderful, beautiful people helpful people <laughs> okay number three i don't know if it will work but let's give it a try let's give it a try okay good okay everyone number four number four countdown five four three two one okay here we go number four thank you juliet thank you okay here we go number four I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Second time. I'm taking the test to challenge myself. See, Julia, everyone's welcoming you. So we have a, a nice community here. You could see all the green people um saying welcome welcome juliet so we are all together here together we are here together all of us are here together with the same purpose okay the third time and lolly only needs two here's the third time i'm taking the test to challenge myself okay lolly's on the board i'm taking the test to challenge myself. Very good, very good. Okay, Marcos, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Larissa, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Mohammed, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Tetsuro, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Very good. Ugh. Okay, Ava. 
Okay, Ava. Mwah. See you next time, Ava. Have a good day. Muhammad, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Tomas, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Rita, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Larissa, Emily, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Thank you, Ava. You're welcome. Mwah. See you next time, Ava. See you next. Actually, I'm going to, okay, Ava, I will be here tomorrow at 10 a.m., okay? So let me say this now to everyone. I am taking the test to challenge myself. Good, Sabine. So right now, my universe, I'm on summer break, so I am going to be here on tomorrow, again, 10 a.m., okay? So I will be here Wednesday. Okay, this no, this is not the normal time, but um, I will be here tomorrow, August 26th, right? Today's 25th, yeah. So August 26th at 10 a.m. Japan time, right? So I live in Japan, so this is Japan time. Okay, so August 26th, 10 a.m. I will be here. I will be here tomorrow, 10 a.m. Special, <laughs> because I'm free tomorrow, so I'll be here 10 a.m. Wednesday, 10 a.m. Floor, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Good, good, good. Okay, nicely done, everybody. This is number four. Okay, Juliet, I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Very good, Juliet. Yes, you got it, Juliet. Nice. I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Yeah, Tetsuro, I will be here tomorrow morning, 10 a.m. Okay, good, Ava. See you tomorrow, Ava. India time, I'm not sure, Emmy. I don't know the India time. Google, Google Japan, 10 a.m., and then um, what time is it in India? So go check that out. I'm taking the test to challenge myself. Okay, good. Okay, number five, everyone, number five. Okay, here we go. Countdown, number five. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Number five. I enjoy a challenge. Uh, Maya. I don't like to see that, Maya. Oh, that's 4 a.m. for Maya. Maybe this is better for you, Maya. <laughs> Ow. Is it now? 4 a.m. now? Two, second time. I enjoy a challenge. Yes, Rita, number five. Thank you, Rita. And the third time. I enjoy a challenge. Okay, Henna's on the board. I enjoy a challenge. A challenge. Okay, Rita, I enjoy a challenge. Good, Lolly, I enjoy a challenge. Tetsuro, I enjoy a challenge. Good, good, good. Larissa, I enjoy a challenge. Nice. Violet, I enjoy a challenge. Marginal voice, I enjoy a challenge. Mohammed, single, I enjoy a challenge. Sabine. Whoa. 4 a.m. That's early. Ah. Marcos, I enjoy a challenge. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, okay, Violet, good. Floor, good. Tomas, yes. Okay, no problem, everybody. This is, this is a short one, right? No problem. Sabine, good. Gratitude. Oh, okay, okay, but, um, Thank you, Rita. But I can't play music from famous people. Otherwise, YouTube like will stop will will um, stop my video. Okay, so so it has to be like general. You know, like happy 
birthday music, like, mm, happy birthday to you. So it has to be something very generic, and it can't be some from someone famous or YouTube will, um, s like, stop my video. Juliet, I enjoy a challenge. Good, good. Uh, ah, at my place when it's 10 a.m. in Japan. Ah, okay. So right now, it's probably okay for you, right? But 10 a.m., ah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Maya. Oh, that's early. Okay, I enjoy a challenge. Okay, let's go number six, everyone. Number six, here we go. Countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Number six. Climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Okay, this is the third time. Climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Okay, Jennifer, I enjoy a challenge. Oh, I'm sorry. Norton, sometimes I don't see you. Okay, so Norton, I'm sorry. I didn't see you. I see you now, and I'm sorry, Norton. Norton, I'm sorry, Norton. Sometimes I don't see everybody. Okay, Lolly, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Very good. MD, hello. How are you doing? We're doing dictation right now, MD. Tetsuro, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Good. Marcos, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Marginal voice, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Amy, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Ah, thank you. Thank you, Maya. Samuel, climbing, the, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Rita, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Good, good. Muhammad, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Okay, Muhammad Single, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Okay, good, everyone. Okay, Amora, Henna, Ella, good. Larissa, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Okay, Norton, I see Norton right now. Climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. MD, that mountain, that mountain. Floor, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Good, Sabine, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Good, Tomas, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. No, 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 Larissa. Climbing, C-L-I. See, okay, Larissa, look at Tomas's, Tomas, climbing. Look, look, look there, Larissa. Look up to Tomas, climbing, C-L-I-M-B, I-N-G. Okay, Violet, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Good. Yes, Norton, I see you. Okay, Rita, climbing the Everest is the biggest challenge. <laughs> yes. Juliet, climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Good, Juliet. Climbing that mountain was quite a challenge. Was quite a challenge. Okay, number seven, everyone. Number seven, countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Number seven. First time. Oh, Tetsuro. Very good, Tetsuro. We are going to try surfing this summer. 
nerfed it. Second time, we're going to try surfing this summer. Third time, we are going to try surfing this summer. Yes, floor number seven. Rita, thank you. Good, Larissa. Did you get it? Number seven, everyone. Three times. I read it three times. That's all you get is three times. Okay, Lolly's on the board. We're going to try surfing this summer. Very good. We're going to try surfing this summer. Very good. Okay, Rita, we are going to try surfing this summer. Yes. Yes, Rita. Okay, MD, we are going to try surfing this summer. Good, Tetsuro, we are going to try surfing this summer. Okay, Norton, we are going to try surfing this summer. We are, we are, we are. Larissa, we are going to try surfing this summer. Samuel, we are going to try surfing this summer. Tomas, we are going to try surfing this summer. Good. Hannah, Floor, we are going to try surfing this summer. Levin, we are going to try surfing this summer. Mohammed, we are going to try surfing this summer. Sabine, we are going to try surfing this summer. Marginal Voice, we are going to try surfing this summer. Good, good, good. Amy, we are going to try surfing this summer. To try, yes, Larissa, we are going to try. Marcos, we are going to try surfing this summer. Ella, we are going to try surfing this summer. Good. Maya, we are going to try surfing this summer. Okay, there is Violet. We are going to try surfing this summer. Good. Juliet, we are going to try surfing this summer. Okay, good. Let's, I'm looking at the clock. We need to get moving faster. So this will be the last card. Okay, this is, right now is the last card. We're not going to do eight. We're going to do seven because of time. Okay, Julia, we are going to try surfing this summer. Perfect, perfect, yes. We are going to try surfing this summer. Marcos, we are going, we are surfer when you, were, were you a surfer when you were younger, Mark? Yes, I was. And I can still surf. But I live, where I live, there's no beach, so I don't really surf much anymore. But I can still surf, Marcos. Yes, I can. <laughs> I can still surf. Okay, now it's time for dictation practice. Dictation practice, okay? Not dictation, shadowing. We just did dictation, right? Step one was dictation practice. Now, step two is shadowing. Shadowing, you're speaking at the same time as I am, right? Input, output, input, output, okay? So now it is time. Sorry, Rita, we're going to stop right now because of time, okay, Rita? I'm sorry. Um, so right now, I want, now it's time for speaking practice. Step one was listening and writing. Now it is speaking time, okay? Here we go. Shadowing time, countdown, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, here we go. Sabine, so n not number eight. So here's eight. Eight is not happening today. <laughs> eight is not happening. Okay, here we go. <clears throat> no, Rita, no eight. Okay, I'm looking at the clock, and we, we got to get going. Okay, here we go. Shadowing time, five, four, three, two, one. She is always looking for new challenges. 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 I challenged Dave and Tom to a race. 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 
I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Anna, you got the cards. Anna and Larissa got the cards. Anna, mwah, mwah. thank you so much, Anna. Anna is on the board, as always. Anna's always on the board. Anna's a, a big supporter. Anna, thank you so much. Mwah. I like the cat. Thank you so much, Anna. Ah, oh, Anna. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. It's the cat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, Anna, thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. I don't know if it will work, but let's give it a try. Hold on, I have to, somebody is, okay. Number four, everybody, number four. I'm taking the test to challenge myself. 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 I enjoy a challenge. 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 Climbing that mountain was quite 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 a challenge. We are going to try surfing this summer. 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 Okay, yes, we did it. We did it. We challenged. I challenged you to dictation practice. I also challenged you to shadowing practice, and you did it. Thanks, everyone. Nicely done. Yes, yes, yes. And Larissa and Anna get the cards. Yes, they get the dictation cards because they sent me a super sticker. If you do the same thing, I will send you these cards. I need a super sticker and I need your email address and I will send you the cards. Yes, okay, great, great. All right, now it's time for Lolly's Revenge. Yes, Lolly's Revenge is a conversation between two people, Sue and Joe. No. <laughs> Joe and Sue, Joe, Joe and Sue, Joe and Sue, okay? So there'll be four steps. Step one, I will read the conversation. Step two, I will ask you questions about the conversation. Step three, I will, we will read the conversation together. And step four, we will shadow the conversation. Yes, we will. Good, 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 good. Oh, oh, and I need the whiteboard, okay? So I got to erase this, but before I erase it, I am going to take a picture of it. So that way, you can check it out anytime you want to. Go to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, to see the whiteboards. Okay, and there is the camera, and I'm going to take a picture. Okay, here we go. Countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, I got the picture. And now I am going to erase the board. Yes, it's Lolly's Revenge. It's 
Lolly's Revenge. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Lolly's Revenge. Okay. Like I said, there are four steps. Step one, I will read the conversation. If you want me to read it again, you say OMT. That means one more time. If you want me to read it slower, you say MS, which means more slowly. If you got it and you say, okay, let's do it the last time, and that means last time, and that's it. LS. LT. <laughs> Oh. LS, no, LT, last time. Okay? One more time, more slowly, last time. And that's it for step one. Step two is question time. Question time. I have today five questions, okay? So question time is, I will ask you those questions. S step... Three, reading. Okay, so step three, we will read the conversation together, all right? And then four is shadowing. And that is speaking practice. So you can see there is lots to do here, right? I'm going to read the conversation. I'm going to ask you questions about the conversation. We will read the conversation together, and we will shadow the conversation, okay? So let's do it, shall we? Yes, we shall. Okay, let's do it, let's do it. Let's do it, let's do it. Okay, okay, let me get this on the board here. All right. Like I said, this is Joe. Please say hello to Joe. This is Sue. Please say hello to Sue. Hello, Joe. Hello, Sue. Okay, here we go. Joe is first. Sue, want to try this? What is it? It's a casserole. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. Is there tuna fish inside? Yes, it's a tuna casserole. I think it needs more flavor. Okay, back to the kitchen. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Don't worry, I will succeed. Do you need any help? Do you need any help? Okay, so that's one time we need it again, right? One time's not enough. So I'm going to read it OMT. One more time. Okay, here we go. OMT. This is Joe. Sue, want to try this? What is it? It's a casserole. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. Is there tuna fish inside? Yes, it's a tuna casserole. I think it needs more flavor. Okay, back to the kitchen. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Don't worry, I will succeed. Do you need any help? Do you need any help? Larissa, OMTMS. O-M-T-M-S. One more time, more slowly. Okay, okay. O-M-T-M-S. This is for Larissa. Larissa, here we go. O-M-T-M-S. Sue, want to try this? What is it? It's a casserole. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. Is there tuna fish inside? Yes, it's a tuna casserole. I think it needs 
more flavor. Okay, back to the kitchen. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Don't worry, I will succeed. Do you need any help? <laughs> no, Tetsuro, casserole, casserole. Yes, Maya. Okay, uh, Tetsuro, look, look at Maya, casserole. Yes, Julia, casserole. Lolly, yes, tuna casserole. <laughs> it's American. Tuna casserole is American. <laughs> tuna casserole is American food. Okay, what are we doing, everybody? What's happening? No problem, Tetsuro. Casserole. Yes, Rita, casserole. Okay, what are we doing, everybody? What's going on here? No, no, Lolly. Casserole is not a stew. It's a dish. And, um, okay, last time, MS. Okay, Lolly, I will show you a picture of tuna casserole. So it's a dish, and it's, it's not a stew. It's um, kind of like, use like a, um, it's like with pasta and uh, like, um, Bisquick, maybe like a powder, like a, like a pancake mix, but it's a little different. I'm going to show you, I'm going to show you tuna casserole. Tuna casserole. Here we go. Let's find a good picture. Okay, this is pretty good. Okay, this is a pretty, pretty good picture. Okay, this is a tuna casserole. So you can see there's like, um, it's kind of cheesy with, with um, pasta. So it's kind of cheesy with, with pasta and anything. Just, you could put anything in it. Just anything in it, it's okay. There's like green peas in there. There's tuna fish in there. There's anything you can, you can put anything you want. <laughs> it's just a mix of, it's just a mix of lots of things. And the main ingredients are um, pasta, like noodles, right? Pasta and cheese. And then uh, you just put whatever else you want to put in. Yeah, it is very delicious. It's delicious. Okay, let's do it. Um, okay, last time, more slowly. Okay, Tetsuro, very good. Well, Rita, high calories. <laughs> so it, it's healthy, but high calories because it has like a cream and cheese. So it, it's kind of creamy and cheesy and it's high calories, but it, it, it's, it's feeling like, woo, I'm full. So it's not bad for you. I wouldn't say, it's not health food. It's not, it is not health food, no. Oh, hello, Muhammad. Uh, we are doing Lolly's Revenge, and we are doing um, MSLT. So you get, Muhammad, you get one chance before the questions, okay? So Muhammad, listen carefully because you get one chance only. Okay, here we go. This is Joe. We're going. Last time, more slowly, everyone. Sue, I want to try. No, 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 no. Sorry. Sue, want to try this? What is it? It's a casserole. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. 
Is there tuna fish inside? Yes, it's a tuna casserole. I think it needs more flavor. Okay, back to the kitchen. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Don't worry, I will succeed. Do you need any help? Do you need any help? Like, yeah, yeah, okay, like a lasagna, but not exactly. Lasagna, that's a good question. The, the, like, like lasagna. Lasagna uses like um, flat pasta, you know, like a sheet of pasta in layers. So like a lasagna would be like a, sh you know, a, a long sheet of pasta, meat, cheese, pasta, meat, cheese, right? And it's, and there's layers, right? Where casseroles, everything's just mixed together. It's just a, uh, uh, anything you, is okay. Anything in there, but the main ingredients is like you have pasta, but like the, the like ravioli, like raviolis or like the um, short pasta, like the short pasta, cheese, and then you put anything in it, like leftover. Let's say you, like yesterday you had chicken Alfredo. You put that in. Uh, or maybe you had some kind of um, vegetable dish. You put that in. So you could, you could do anything with it. It's, it's, anything is okay. Okay, okay, okay. Good, good, good. All right. Now it's time for question time. Step two. Step two, question time. Here we go. Are you ready? Question number one. Oh, Jojo, I will eat it when I go to USA. Yes. So you have to, Jojo, ask for a casserole. Oh, I want to eat a casserole. Can you make a casserole? So, so please request a casserole. Okay, here we go. Question number one. Question number one. What did Joe do? What did Joe do? Question number one. What did Joe do? Yes, marginal voice. Question time. Question number one. What did Joe do? Question number one. What did Joe do? Okay, okay. Lolly, what did he do? Do, do, do. So tuna casserole, yes, but what, I want a verb, okay? So Lolly, I, I want to see a verb. So tuna casserole is a noun, it's a thing, right? That's, that's what it is, but what did he do? Okay, um, sand night. Okay, so, okay, uh, Tetsuro says he challenged cooking dinner, okay? Yeah, Gaga, what did Joe do? Okay, Joe, did, right? That's past tense. What did he do? So, he, what did he do? Okay, Ella, he cooked a tuna casserole. Julia, he cooked a tuna casserole. Yes. Okay, he did a cat. Okay, it's better to say he made or he cooked. Okay, so I either he cooked a tuna casserole or he made a tuna casserole. Okay, so either is okay. He made, he cooked. He made, he cooked. He made, he cooked. Yeah, Lolly, he made a tuna casserole. Perfect. Yep. What did Joe do? He made uh tuna casserole okay anna he did a cooking challenge okay okay anna we need a uh. that works anna that works he did a cooking challenge yeah good anna he did a cooking challenge so anna i want you to write your answer one more time 
he did a cooking challenge. Yeah, so maybe you sometimes, I like, do you ever watch the cooking channel? And do you ever see like the game show and they're doing a cooking challenge? I like that. You know, so there's one show that I like and it's called, um, what's it called? I forgot the name, but it's on the cooking network. And they, they open a basket and there's like ingredients, right? And they have to make something from the ingredients, right? So they open a basket and there might be, you know, like a potato, a piece of meat, uh, you know, broccoli and sugar, something like that. So they have ingredients and they have to m cook something with the ingredients. So it's very, it's very fun watching them do a cooking challenge. So I like watching that. Okay, Anna, thank you. She, you did it. He did a cooking challenge. Perfect. Okay, number two, everyone. Number, oh, Sabine says he, he would challenge to cook. Okay, okay. Sabina, he would, we don't say would, he challenged himself to cook dinner. Okay, Sabine, I want you to write a new sentence, Sabine. He challenged himself to cook dinner. Sabine, he challenged himself to cook dinner. Sabine, please write that down. He challenged himself, sorry, he challenged himself to cook dinner. Okay, Tomas, he tried to cook a tuna sa casserole. Perfect. He tried to cook a tuna casserole. Good, 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 good. Okay, there's Nurton. Is there one, is there who wants speaking practice? Oh, okay, yeah, Nurton. Good idea, Nurton. Okay, he tried to cook a tuna salad, a tuna casserole, not a salad, tuna casserole. Good. Okay, here we go. Question number two, question number two. What did Sue say about the casserole? Question two. What did Sue say about the casserole? Okay, here we go, Sabine, thank you. He challenged himself to cook dinner. Perfect, Sabine, yes, Sabine. Amra, he challenged himself to cook dinner. Yes. Question number two. What did Sue say about the casserole? What did Sue say about the casserole? What did Sue say about the casserole? O okay. I'm going to be here tomorrow. So Tara has a question about the next live stream. Next live stream is tomorrow, 10 a.m. Right here. There's the next one. Tomorrow morning, 10 a.m. Lolly is on the board. Okay, number two. She said it needs more flavor. Yes, perfect, Lolly. Anna, Sue said it was not good. Okay, Anna, yeah. Okay, yep. That I accept that, yes. Tetsuro, she said, the tuna casserole is difficult to cook. Ah, uh, not, not exactly. Okay, I'll, I'll say that. I will, okay, Tetsuro, I will accept that. Okay, Mohammed single. She said, it needs more flavor. Good, it needs more flavor. It needs more flavor. Larissa, she said to have a little easier challenge. Okay, Larissa. Julia, she said a casserole was not. Okay, so Julia, she said the casserole did not have enough flavor. Or she, okay, Julia, it needs more flavor. The casserole needs more flavor. The casserole needs more flavor flavor. Okay, Tomas, she said it needs some more flavor. Okay, good, Maya. Or I mean Tomas, yes, good Tomas. She said it needs some more flavor. Maya, she expected a more loud taste from the, 
Okay, we don't use loud taste, um, Maya. Um, more taste. It needs more taste. So we don't need loud. That doesn't work. So that does not collocate. So loud taste does not, they do not go together. More taste goes together. So it needs more taste. Sue expected more taste from the casserole. Okay, Maya, I want you to write the sentence. Sue expected more taste from the casserole. But actually, more flavor is better. Okay, Maya? Sue expected more flavor from the casserole. Sue expected more flavor from the casserole. Okay, Maya? Sue expected more flavor from the casserole. Yeah, Tessa, it needs more flavor. Good, good. She, okay, Lolly, she said the casserole is bland. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Bland means no flavor, without flavor. Bland means without flavor, without flavor. Okay, good, good, good. Sabine, she says it takes more, she says it takes more flavor. It needs more flavor. Sabine, she said it needs more flavor. Sabine, she said it needs more flavor. Yeah, more taste, Maya. Ella, the casserole needs probably salt or pepper. Okay, good. Yeah, because salt and pepper will add the flavor, right? Especially salt. Salt will bring out the flavor. When the meal is bland, you need more flavor. That's right, Lolly. When the meal is bland, you need more flavor. More flavor, yes, Maya. Okay, let's go to question number three. Question number three. What did Sue suggest to Joe? Number three. What did Sue suggest to Joe. Ooh. This might be a difficult question, everybody. I think it's difficult. Let's see how you do. Let's see how you do. Question number three. What did Sue suggest to Joe? What did Sue suggest to Joe? Number three. So I want you to say three. Okay, I want your, your answer I want to see three. This is answer. This is question number three. Marginal voice. No. That was question two. Question, okay, marginal voice. That is two. I want, we have a new one, number three. Question number three. What did Sue suggest to Joe? Number three. I want to see three, and it's not flavor, okay? The answer is not flavor. Number three. What did Sue suggest to Joe? 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 Three. Three. What did Sue suggest to Joe? Three. And it's not taste, not taste. Oh, henna. <laughs> nice. Ramen. Okay. I thought this would be difficult. Lolly. Yes. Sue suggested that he should challenge himself to something a little easier. Ah, oh, yeah, you guys. Nice, nice. Yes, yes. Sue suggested to him to try cooking something easier. Yes. I thought this would be difficult. You guys, Aki, she suggested more practice to cook. Or she suggested more practice, more practice cooking. So two, we don't need. She suggested more practice cooking. Okay, Aki, she suggested more practice cooking. Okay, should. Yeah, Lolly. Sue suggested that he should. You just, yeah, that's okay, Lolly. That's just. 
Nice, nice. That is the answer. Yeah. I thought that was going to be a trick question. You did it. Tomas, she suggested to Joe to cook some, some simpler food first. Okay, Tomas, she suggested to Joe to cook some simpler, simpler food first. Simpler food, simpler. Anna, she suggested, she suggested him to try to cook something easier. Yes, she suggested for him. Okay, Anna, she suggested for him to try to cook something easier. Whoa, this is difficult. Okay, Anna, please write this down. Sue suggested for him to try to cook something easier. Sue suggested for him to try to cook something easier. Sh Sue suggested for him to try to cook something easier. Marcos, Sue, Joe, what about something a little easier? Good, Marcos. Marginal voice. She suggested to cook something easier. Tetsuro, is it casserole American traditional food? Yes, it is. Yes, it is, Tetsuro. Casserole is American traditional food. Yes, it is. Okay, Gaga. He suggested more practice cooking. Yes. Uh, Roman. Joe can only cook water. <laughs> boil water. Okay, Roman, we don't say cook water. Boil. B-O-I-L. Boil water. Boil water. Marcos, Joe, what about a burger delivery? <laughs> How about takeout? So, Marcos, Sue to Joe. How about takeout? How about takeout? Okay, good, good. How about takeout? That's funny, Marcos. Yeah, <laughs> everyone's laughing. How about takeout? Hey, Joe, how about takeout? Forget cooking. Don't try. How about takeout? Don't try. Give it up. <laughs> okay, here we go. Question number four, everyone. Number four. Number four. Yeah, Gaga. Okay, number four. Does Joe feel confident? Number four. Does Joe feel confident? Number four. Does Joe feel confident? Simpler. Yes, Tomas. Something simpler. Something simpler. Something simpler. Okay, number four. Does Joe feel confident? Yes, Gaga. How about takeout? <laughs> Don't try cooking. Let's go. Let's let's do takeout. Let's do takeout. Number four. Does Joe feel confident? Lolly is on the board. Number four. Yes, he thinks he will succeed. Okay, t Lolly. He thinks he will succeed. He thinks he will succeed. Lolly, he thinks he will succeed. Maya, Sue should have support Joe. Joe might stop trying to cook after this kind of reaction. <laughs> yes, you have to build confidence. You have to give confidence. That's right. You have to give Joe confidence. Okay, Norton, I must go. Okay, Norton. See you tomorrow, 10 a.m. Norton. Good, good, good. Norton, Norton, Norton. Okay, Gaga, does Joe feel confident? Yes. Marcos, yes, he does. Ella, yes, he does. Okay, Lolly, he thinks he will succeed. Yes. Good, Lolly, that's right. Julia, yes, he does. Tomas, he feels confident. Good, everyone. Joe was assertive. <laughs> Larissa, yes, he feels success. 
Oh, Larissa, he feels success. Oh, I feel success. Good, Larissa. I like it. I like it. Okay, let's do number five, everyone. Here we go. Number five. Last one. Is Sue confident that Joe will succeed? Now, question number five. Is Sue confident that Joe will succeed? Is Joe, uh, blah, blah, blah. is Sue confident that Joe will succeed? Number five. Is Sue confident that Joe will succeed? Rita, yes, he does for sure. Muhammad, single, yes, he feels success. He feels success. Julia, G, G, G. Is that good, great, um, gorgeous? I don't know. What is G, 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 Julia? Marginal voice. Yes, he, he does. He thinks he will succeed. Yes, yes. Okay, number five, Tetsuo. No, she isn't. You're asked. Number five, is Sue confident that Joe will succeed? And Tetsuo says, no, she isn't. Anna says, Sue is so picky. Anna says, Sue is so picky. Okay, I'm going to... No, Sue doesn't f feel confident. No, Sue doesn't feel confident. Lolly. No, because she asked him, do you need help? Yes, yes. That's the reason. That's why. That's why. Tomas, no, she doesn't. Larissa, I think not. She offered him help. Okay, Larissa, I want you to fix your sentence one more time, Larissa. I think not. I think not. She offered him him help. I think not. She offered him help. I think not. She offered him help. Marginal voice. No, she isn't. She tells him if he needs any help. She asked him. Okay, that's a question. She asked him if he needs any help. 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 Thank you, language chef. <laughs> Amra, no, Sue doesn't feel confident. Very good. Okay, Violet, no, she isn't confident. Very good. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, great. <clears throat> My voice is... <clears throat> Muhammad, no, because she asked him, do you need help? Good, good, good. Okay, Tetsuro, I will challenge a casserole someday because it looks delicious. Yes, Tetsuro, very easy. Very easy. Just go Google casserole, okay? And there's many kinds, and you can do it. It's easy. You can do it. Larissa, I think not. She offered him help. I like that sentence, Larissa. I think not. She offered him help. I think not. She offered him help. <laughs> I like it, Larissa. Okay, now we got to get going. Now it's step three. We did questions. Now it's time for reading. So I'm going to hold... I'm going to hold the conversation up to the camera so we can read it together. Okay, let's read it together, shall we? Yes, we shall. Okay, good, good, good. Here we go. Let's read it together. Okay, here we go. Well, I'm going to move my computer screen a little bit. Okay, so now get it close. Okay, here we go. Joe is first. Sue, want to try this? What is it? It's a casserole. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. Is there a tuna fish inside? Yes, it's a tuna casserole. I think it needs more flavor. Okay, back to the kitchen. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself 
to something a little easier. Don't worry, I will succeed. Do you need any help? <laughs> oh, Sue, Sue, you are not being very helpful. Or she's not, she's not giving Joe any confidence, right? She is not giving Joe confidence. Okay, here we go. One more time. Sue, want to try this? What is it? It's a casserole. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. Is there tuna fish inside? Yes, it's a tuna casserole. I think it needs more flavor. Okay, back to the kitchen. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Don't worry, I will succeed. Do you need any help? <laughs> oh, Sue, let Joe, give Joe confidence. Yeah, tell him, you can do it, Joe. Give him, give him confidence. Give him some pep talk, right? Give him, give him like some advice, yeah? Okay, now, oh, you made it? Yes, we make it in the oven. A casserole we make in an oven. Okay. Step four, shadowing, right? So we did the dictation card, shadowing. Now let's shadow the conversation, okay? So I want you to speak at the same time as I do. Input, output, input, output. Okay, here we go. Shadowing time, countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Sue, want to try this? Sue, want to try this? Want to try this? Want to try this? What is it? What is it? What is it? It's a casserole. It's a casserole. It's a casserole. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. Is there tuna fish inside? Is there tuna fish inside? Is there tuna fish inside? Yes, it's a tuna casserole. Yes, it's a tuna casserole. Yes, it's a tuna casserole. I think it needs more flavor. I think it needs more flavor. I think it needs more flavor. Okay, back to the kitchen. Okay, back to the kitchen. Okay, back to the kitchen. So that means now Joe, so Sue said, okay, it needs more flavor. So Joe said, oh, okay, back to the kitchen, meaning he's going to go back and um, add more flavor. Okay, so he's back to the kitchen, meaning he's going to go and, and try again. I'm going to try again. Back to the kitchen, I'm going to try again. Perhaps... You should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Don't worry, I will succeed. 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 Do you need any help? <laughs> Do you need any help? Do you need any help? Do you need any help? Oh, Juliet! Thank you, Juliet. Bye bye. Mwah. Juliet, thank you so much for joining today. Yes. So, Juliet is our new member, our newest member. So, thank you, Juliet. Mwah. And maybe I will see you tomorrow at 10 a.m. Okay, Juliet, thank you so much. Mwah. Okay, let's read it one more time. Okay, I'm going to put the computer screen back a little so I could. Put this up closer. Okay, here we go. Let's read it one more time. Sue, want to try this? What is it? It's a casserole. I thought I would challenge myself to cooking 
I'm sorry, one more time. I made a mistake. It's a casserole. I thought I would challenge myself to cook dinner. Is there tuna fish inside? Yes, it's a tuna casserole. I think it needs more flavor. Okay, back to the kitchen. Perhaps you should have challenged yourself to something a little easier. Don't worry, I will succeed. Do you need any help? Do you need any help? Okay, good, 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 good. Joe, Joe has to add some seasoning to his tuna casserole. Yes, Lolly, Joe has to. Joe has to add some seasoning to his tuna casserole. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, we did it, everyone. Woohoo! All right, it's been over two hours, two hours and 20 minutes almost. <coughs> wow, so I'm, I'm pushing myself to the limit right now. But I'm feeling better. I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm strong, everyone. I'm still healing. It's not 100%, but I'm getting, I'm getting better day by day. Yeah, my surgery. I was cut here, so I'm doing better day by day. And I did, today I did over two hours. Yeah, so I had fun. Thank you, everyone, for being here with me. Um, we did a lot today. We did um, how do you feel activity. We did which one doesn't belong activity. We did dictation cards activity. And we did Lolly's revenge activity. Wow, we did a lot. And thank you for being here with me. Thank you for staying with me for over two hours Mwah. you guys are the best you are number one and i want to say thank you again to larissa and anna for your super stickers you will get the dictation cards and um for helping me i'm going to get you the dictation cards and all that stuff and so we just had a, we had a new member join today juliet joined so um, please, let's, let's get this team bigger and let's get the team stronger, yeah? Um, more the merrier. So please consider joining the channel. That would be fantastic. And um, there are lots of ways to support me so I can support you, yeah? Support me so I can support you. I have a Patreon page. I have, of course, you could join the channel. I have a website, markkulik.com. I have books. I have a mug, so you could check it out in the descriptions for everything in the descriptions, and I will be back here tomorrow to do it again with you, 10 a.m., okay, August 26th, which is tomorrow morning, Japan time, okay? So thanks, everyone. You guys are the best, and I really appreciate you guys are here with the whole time we were here for two over two hours two two hours and 20 minutes i think anyway so thanks so much everyone um it's time to go i need to um stop <laughs> i have to stop okay so let's count down together to stop the stream okay so let's count down together shall we okay good good okay here we go let's count down together you and me you and me together here we go five Four, three, two, one. Okay, thanks, everyone. I'll see you next time, okay? And take it easy. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye.